Hello and welcome back to another one of my quick vids. So, a couple of weeks ago, I was out and about. I saw something on Gumtree, I was interested, so I went and picked it up. And it's this CGL Galaxy Twin Vader. Twin Vader, it's like there are two of them. It's not a two player, it's not a two player game. There's, there's nothing on the back. Um, but yeah, this was pretty interesting. So uh, I thought I'd have a would have a quick look um, and decided to decided to pick it up um, so yeah this was up on Gumtree it was a very reasonable price at least I think it is um, but yeah as you can tell it's it's possibly not in the best of Nick um, and I'll tell you why because there's an interesting story behind it so this comes courtesy of Matt uh, from Mattershall and uh, and yeah basically Matt was helping out his mate um, take down a, uh, a shed in his garden. He'd been told that his, uh, his shed needed to be taken down. It wasn't in the best of repair. Um, and as they were taking it down, they found a bunch of things buried. Well, I say buried. And, and if we look really closely, um, yeah, you could actually say it was buried. Um, sort of under a bit of carpet in a, in a dugout section underneath the, um, underneath the, the shed. Um, so if we have a, if we have a quick quick look you can see that it's it really does look like it's been under the earth for a little while um, obviously there's some staining there and such like um, yeah it's I dare say it's seen some action it's a little lighter underneath than it is sort of around the, around the back and on the top um, so I dare say it has seen some sunshine and some use in the past but um, yeah it's it's a bit grubby and this has had a bit of a tidy up as well um so yeah i quite like to know if it works um matt popped some batteries in it couldn't get it to work um i've got some batteries let's give it another go also got a little bit of emery cloth well it's not emery cloth it's wet and dry actually just to just to deal with the contacts if it's uh, if it's not quite right. <clears throat> Excuse me. So yeah, let's have a let's have a look at this. The buttons all seem to work. It feels like it does. This is exceptionally it's exceptionally difficult to slide. So it's probably quite heavily corroded. Could be part of the problem. Um, the little stick says left and right. Splendid. It's not centering very well. But also I'd happen to notice that it kind of goes up and down as well. I'm not entirely sure that's supposed to travel in any orientation like that. So we'll see. So let's pop the back off and have a quick look at the... Uh, ooh. Ooh. It is a bit dirty, isn't it? Oh, check that out. Let's have a, let's have a quick look. Ooh. Oh. Oh dear. Yeah, I'm going to shake this out over the bin. Hold on a second. Oh, there's still bits. There's still bits coming out. Hopefully it's just the the earth from where it's like I say, it was in a bit of a dugout with a with the carpet over it. They didn't even know it was there um, until they were pulling the shed down. So, uh, so yeah, a bit weird. So here we go. Here we go then. Batteries in. Let's see if we can get it to do something oh dear i could use an adapter but I, I actually quite like i actually quite like batteries these things would have been using batteries back in the day not too many people had the adapters i don't think um so there's something very authentic and you know it gives it a nice weight um too so there's something quite authentic about using uh batteries in these things I, I, it just it just feels right okay here we go moments of truth on oh Okay, well that's not really a surprise in all fairness. Um, let's try the other way because we've we've got on mute. Sorry, on off and mute. So we can play it quietly. So our parents wouldn't know that we were playing games at night. No, nothing there either. So let's pop the batteries out. Let's have a quick look. Literally, just give it the uh, just give it the once over. Oh, still still leaking uh soil or something in there so just give it the uh just give it the once over 
just in case tidying up those contacts will make any difference. I don't think they will, to be honest. But it's worth a shot, isn't it? Just to see if we know how how much trouble I'm going to get into when I when I try and refurb this. Okay, let's put these back in again. See if we've made any difference whatsoever. It's unlikely, but then if it works straight off the bat, where would be the fun in that? Exactly. So, pop this back together, fingers crossed, switch it on. Oh, and nothing again. No surprise, but there we go. Okie doke. So, this is going to feature on a, on a refurb. What I'd like to do is, one, get it working, and two, retro bright it. See if we can get that back to a, to a decent colour. I don't know. There's not even a decent colour to show you. Oh, check that bit out. I hadn't seen that. Looks like that might still have a little bit of soil in there still. <laughs> Who knows? But there we go. So, Galaxy Twin Vader. It's another sort of a Space Invaders style game. A little bit different. Um, you probably can't tell unless I try and zoom in really closely. Um... There we go. But you can see that the play field is actually quite wide. There are several elements to the game um, in this uh, in this particular handheld. So, uh, so yeah, looking forward to getting that um, up and running and added to my collection. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in another video soon. Hold on, past Chris. Something funny was going on there. So, I don't know if you guys spotted it. I didn't spot it until Mrs. Retro Corner pointed it out. There was some funny stuff going on there just for a moment. So let's back this up. I think was it four four minutes four minutes and eighteen seconds. And just let's have another look at this bit. Okay, here we go. Moments of truth. On. Oh, OK, well, that's not really a surprise, in all fairness. Um, let's try the other way, because we've we've got on, mute, sorry, on, off and mute. So we can play it quietly, so our parents wouldn't know that we were playing games at night. No, nothing there either. So, did you see that? Did you see that? Something funny was going on there. So there was a, there was another bit that looked a little curious, and I think that was five minutes fifty two. So let's just uh, let's just move the marker there for a second. So let's have another look at this bit as well. This back together, fingers crossed. Switch it on. Oh, and nothing again. No surprise. Did you see that? I saw that but only after I'd previewed it to Mrs. Retro Corner um, and I missed it in the, I missed it in the edit. But yeah, there were signs of life. So let's try that again. Let's add some batteries and just have a, a slightly closer look as to what was going on. I don't know how I missed it. Um, I, could, I could blame the, the light streaming in from the window and the angle of which I was looking at the screen, possibly through the camera. Who knows? I could make up all manner of excuses. But basically, I just missed it. Ooh. There we go. So let's let's try that again. It could be that the, the mere the mere motion of it not being moved for like thirty plus years, um, and then just trying it again did something. Let's let's go. Here, here we go. Quick countdown. Three, two, one. And it is, it's there. Look, it's counting up the levels. Wow, okay. Don't know how to do this. Well, let's, let's try and hit one. <gasps> Goodness gracious. That. Oh. 
Although my little, although my little ship's not working. That, not at all in fact. There are signs of, more than signs of life. That's border, I mean that's practically there. Apart from looking terrible. Actually absolutely terrible. <laughs> wow. So yeah, just moving the switch about did something. So, oh goodness, right, that's very difficult. Oh. Right, okay, don't do this at home. I'm literally just gonna give that a quick blast and let that soak through just in case it changes anything. It might not. Well, it does actually make life a lot easier in that direction. What about the other one? Oh yeah. So there we go, it is working. When you switch it on. Obviously that button's working as well. Yeah, that's a that's a lot easier. So we can't uh oh, straight away look at this. Absolutely Oh, I want to play it. Oh. So we can fire. Fantastic, so that's working. Reset. Yep, that looks like that works. The demo button? Mm, I think we've Let's, let's try that. I think we've got to press demo and then turn it on. There we go. Look at that. Oh, wow. And all the screen elements are working as well. There you go. Fantastic. So, there we go. That's, that's the thing to do. That's the thing to get working. Well, brilliant stuff. Who knew? Who knew? So, going back to past Chris, um, I figure we can say, look forward to seeing you in another video. Take care.